a little bit better with my mouth than my hands. So I will be making the fabulous other outfits we'll be playing tonight. The Lost Lou and Florent Jouel. Um, <laughs> look even more incredible. I'm going to uh, start off with a little tune I wrote about a one of my favorite Russ Myers film um, called Fast Pussy Cat Kill Kill. This is called Girlene. five times over. Uh, up the ante, I always say. Um, this is the next <laughs> I got my first heckler tonight here. Oh my god, from the pros and the experts. First ever, I'm telling you. Because nobody ever tells me to stop playing guitar, as far as I know. Um, this next little tune is all about the shit that went down uh, during Hurricane Katrina, I'm ashamed to say. I uh, felt so bad I had to write a little song about it. This is called Hell Away From Home.
from the previous regime out here on Monkey Isle. But baby doll, little monkey just done subcontracted out to Big Gorilla. <laughs> Still take over my big fat overblown American corporate ass. We are your own personal and private COO, that's Q for short. And we are here to pump up the party action. You can throw away that riding crop sailor when you see what we gotta play with. We give you Top drawer torture, fresh from the fair. We give you special forces fraternity hazing ritual. Hell, if you get enough, you might even get your own aircraft carrier and cruise missile match, put it on somebody's roof and hack me. Okay, here's how it works. The body of Christ, word of God. <laughs> now that I have your complete and undivided attention, I'd like to urge you to jump that gene pool floor and tell you new asshole soldier. Don't you roll over and give me your yellow belly bullshit. You've been colorized, KKK'd, and caught in the crossfire. Okay. 
Adoption. I don't know if you guys are, are, are old enough to remember when that program, Adoption on Trial, came up and there was this one little kid who would like put out a one ad, he was like 10 years old, looking for parents or a family. And you know, of course the adoption agencies, whatever sort of cross-sectoral authorities were involved, wouldn't allow, you know, they, did, they didn't like the five people who had responded to it, so you know. I was, uh, you know, I don't even like watching TV because I start yelling back at it, but this time I was up and pacing, but I put the fist through the window. And it just made me think about how family is not really a noun, it's a verb. We take care of each other, so they like a family. Okay, um, next little tune. Uh, you, you know how Morrissey used to, if you watch any kind of kitchen sink drama from the 50s, you can like see like tons of films that he's just ripped off, borrowed. So this is my kind of Morrissey uh, to do with um, Streetcar Named Desire. This is called Fade to Blanche.
watch me fade to blanch Just watch me Hey, 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 hey! Jacob Swag's my figure, buddy? What's that supposed to mean? You know, you'd be damn lucky to have me as one of your fraudulent, buffy goo pie specimens. Well, that's because I have to reinvent myself, okay? You tiny little asswipe. Let's just call it my profession, bozo. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We could talk, Swap. Yeah, sure. I do bored Michigan housewife. She does co comes complete with feather duster, Brillo pad, mini bag, the works. Then there's my spanking cool Catholic schoolgirl cookie. She's also got a white Protestant guilt fetish. She's really into thumb sucking and deep eating butt wife, if you know what I mean. Then there's my Valley Jack Lesbo contortionist. And they all go for a cool, mean one and a half grand, so it's not so unreasonable, really. What do you mean you want a sample? Of what? I see. I suppose the customer is always right, even in the age of communication. Here it goes. <sighs> Come on, baby, 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 give it to me. You can do it all for me, baby. I know you want to make me the perfect instrument to send you shrinking and gasping into a quivering, convoluted Big Bang implosion of universal ecstasy. Yeah. Dominate me with your sci-fi sex toy paraphernalia. I'm just itching to be your private utility. Make me the queen of your soap opera fantasy till I burst at my scar tissue seams 
with bubbles and beads and sequins and glitter. And the shine of my shit-eating chagrin blinds the real me is your own dimply, saggy, maggy, soft serve. Okay, that's enough of a preview for now. Phone pal service gets very expensive, if you know what I mean. Yeah, I think I recognize your voice too. Tell me, is your dad's membership the Groucho Club inspired? Good, why don't you meet me there? We go upstairs, you slap me around a little bit, but it warm up for me, loosens the tissues for you. You put me on the ice, we launch right into step-uncle necrophiliac hour, and then you work your magic. <sighs> yeah, mm, lots of love to you too. Okay, bye, bye, bye. <laughs>
about, um, well, I co-wrote it with Bob Collum, actually, uh, who, um, he, he has a, he has a uh, son who's on the autistic spectrum, and um, Creative Partnerships, under the previous administration, had sent over some um, arts practitioners to teach them about animation, and he, um, it really helped him, you know, the sort of uh, image capture helped him with his uh, spelling and uh, numbers. And uh, they since dissolved creative partnerships, as you might well know, and um, he still holds the torch. Two, two years later, he's still creating animation, this kid, and it gets better and better. And, uh, you know, I just have to make a little plea in a case for alternative intelligences. Just one more, do I have to? Okay, <laughs> okay um, y'all are so lovely to me. This is uh, my 12-step program to better guitar playing. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed. Uh, what, what should I do? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 